once anything is out of your reach it is not an option to do nothing because that thing number one it will not happen if you say oh let's just see how it goes no 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 there's no such thing as let's just see how it goes and then it just jumps on you option two is to begin to run around frantically trying to find a way to deal with that situation based on what you know is never going to be enough because remember we said in the beginning that goal that dream whatever it is that elevation is uncommon you cannot get there simply by sitting down and concocting action plans in your mind the third option is what Rahab did she went to the source said it's only God that can do this thing it's only God that can heal cancer it's only God that can take me from this road that I'm doing now and take me into that road that I want it's only God that can put me into the marriage that I desire it's only God that can heal this marriage it's only God that can heal this child whatever it is that in your mind you know it is now not within your power anymore no matter what you do you will not get there without the help of God then you have to develop the habit of going to God because it's a source Rahab was an action taker but the right action action that began with God so our first action was to go to the source which was God and as a result of that she received her uncommon elevation